march to reclaim the right to walk through the streets without being subject to violence, you know, catcalling, sexual harassment, and it's against the larger, it's, it takes a larger stance against violence in any form, and against domestic violence, sexual violence, anti-gay violence, yeah. any racial, homophobic violence, included as well, and anyone can join, and it's every year. It's not women only, yeah. not straight people only, anyone. Is it on the same date, like the same date every year? I think it usually is. Yeah. As close as possible. It has been since Okay, the so what was today's date? Today is the 27th. Seven. April 27th. <laughs> April 27th. Take back the night! Okay. Did you have a particular target or you just went through the city? <laughs> I think the whole, I think for me it's, I don't know who's a rapist and I don't know who's a victim. It's just saying that I have a right and anyone has a right to walk freely. That they're not objects, that they don't deserve your sexual prowess, whatever they're wearing, they don't deserve commentary. Everyone just deserves the right to be free. Right. Yeah. Another big thing though is just bringing a voice to the issue because a lot of people don't really, they're not aware of how like present it actually is and how many people are affected by it. So yeah. It also a platform takes, for that. Yeah, and it also takes shame out of these acts where for years domestic violence and rape, homosexuality were seen as like closeted violences that the victims deserved and this is countering that saying we don't deserve it no matter where we go, no matter what time we're walking on the streets, no matter what we're wearing, we never deserve that treatment. And we're not we're not the vic we can we're not at fault for our own tragedies. All right. Yes. Cool. All right, thank you.